the widening gap between interest rates in Japan and the U.S. has pushed the yen to a 20-year low against the dollar. The currency earlier fell to about 133 to the greenback, which is the lowest since April 2002, currently trading at about 132. Now, the yen's record run of losses has been driven by Japan's continued dovish stance in a world of hawkish-leaning central banks. The Bank of Japan's interest rate settings are still anchored to the floor, while the U.S. Federal Reserve has been planning to accelerate rate hikes to tackle inflation. This divergence makes dollar-denominated assets more attractive for investors seeking higher returns. Now, Japan's government says that it is uh, closely monitoring the situation with a sense of urgency. Japan's central bank has maintained interest rates at ultra-low levels despite the rising cost of living. And the yen's latest slide has brought senior government officials back to a heightened state of alert. あの、為替相場は経済のファンダメンタルズを反映して安定的に推移することが重要でありまして、特にも急速な変動はこれは望ましくないと考えております。the yen's recent sharp declines are inflating already rising prices of imported fuel and food hitting households. It's also emerging as a political hot issue ahead of an upper house election next month. Bank of Japan Governor Haruhiko Kuroda faced political heat for a remark a day earlier that households were becoming more accepting of higher prices, underscoring public sensitivity to rising living costs. Kuroda conceded that wording may have been inappropriate, and he says the remark was made in the context of explaining the need for wages to grow more. Well, meanwhile, Mr. Kuroda repeated his view that a weak yen benefited the economy if its moves were not too sharp. Analysts say a weaker yen likely offers Japan its best chance to secure stable inflation in years.